Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. We're on episode number 20 of Let's Play the Zoroastrian Persian playthrough. I'm 11 now. I have become temperate, patient. I'm so cruel and honest and craven. And this this guy, he deserves an he. I mean, he needs an award. He's made everybody like us. Everybody except for this county. I mean, almost everyone is, is pretty good. Actually, it's probably just the same. He just keeps talking to the same guy. <laughs> Uh, twice. No, but he's doing a good job. I mean, he's all over the place. Looks like my sister is still doing something. My other sister came of age. Can't let her go anywhere. I am her direct liege, so she can't leave. Ha ha ha. Looks like my sister, my eldest sister, did she relocate her capital? Yes, she did. It's over here now. Why did you do that? That is terrible, terrible technology. Much, much worse than down here. I become shy. I'm shy, cruel, craven. I definitely like picking on small animals. Thirteen now. Another sister comes of age. That's three now. And there's a spare who's craven like me. Clearly, the goal has definitely become reunite Persia under an inbred freak. That's the goal now. That's what I want to do. So we're we're gonna have to uh, we're gonna have to marry all of my sisters. Not marry, but like make them concubines. I'm Fourteen, almost there. Speed five goes pretty quick. It is dependent. Uh, basically, speed 5 has no limit to how many days can take. It's just limited by the speed of your PC. So, it goes decently quick on mine. My beloved half-sister is concerned that she's not married. Uh, I'll find you someone nice. Kind of. Not really. By somebody, I mean me. I'll make you feel better. Okay, coming up on February 20th. Got some heresy. I hear money being stolen from the coffers. We have a new regent. My educator hopefully makes me into a good fighter. And... Here comes our birthday. Okay, so we're coming up on the 21st. I have become a brilliant strategist. Wonderful. I am still craven, of course, but uh, that's okay. Improve religious relations. Let's take the ambition to... Ah, uh, we can't take the ambition to get married. Let's try to improve stewardship, because we're so close to level... Oh god, I have no diplomacy. I'm such an idiot. I'm an ugly buffoon with a sword. And I'm betrothed to my sister, so yes, we will... Uh... What would even happen? Like, matrilineal? Not matrilineal. Matrilineal? Not matrilineal. Let's just do that to be safe. It's a divine marriage, right? Everybody knows I'm a big fat coward. Yeah, I'm, I am though. I'm sleeping with my sister. She wants to marry matrilinearly. Okay, fine. It's still gonna be our kid. Whatever makes her happy. We'll take the... Prestige. And now that I've also come of age, it's time to grab up my sisters. <laughs> uh, concubine! Concubine! And this one is too young. We're already married matrilinearly. Matrilineally. It's hard to say that. It's really tricky. So all of a sudden I have 500 prestige from cowardly sleeping with my sisters. We've got room for one more. One, two, three sisters plus a fourth. Now hopefully we're actually able to get some of them impregnant. Impregnated. I'm an unpredictable, unpredictable leader. I picked up a random trait. I hate that trait. Suspected coward for another five years. Jeez. As a suspected coward, your sex appeal diminishes. Do they think I'm a suspected coward because I want to sleep with my sister? Ha 
How does that work? I'm matrilineally married to my sister. All children that I give her will be her dynasty, which is my dynasty. But all the children that I get from my concubines would be of my dynasty. It's just, it's kind of messed up. I mean, it's not, I don't know, it's not that messed up, I guess, but... Let's, uh, let's try to have a son. That'll boost our fertility by 25%. Definitely want to get my sisters pregnant. How often do you hear that? In the real world? I definitely want to get my sister pregnant. I have sisters. Upset because I have not gotten her married. Um... I don't want to banish her, so I'm just gonna say I have not found someone good. This makes her mad at me. Hmm. Probably better to not have my mother. This this one's not quite as good, but close enough. And how are we doing on technology? We can take some... Siege equipment's good. I've actually already been in power for 10 years, so I can change the law. We're under primogenitor. That's fine. Got our riding grounds. Yay! Riding grounds are great because they give you heavy infantry, or heavy cavalry, and horse archers. And horse archers are really good. Hmm. What are you up to, sister? Defending against a peasant revolt. How boring. Okay, I have 2,000 troops. My brother... <sighs> it's just, it, it just runs in the family. Problems. No diplomacy. A homosexual with no diplomacy who is proud and deceitful. Um, in prison. No. <laughs> Arranged marriage. Uh, here, you can marry this woman. And we'll take the prestige. Is my, my sister pregnant? My sister slash wife? Come on. Come on, we're fat together. No. I don't want to make you my spy master. You'll kill me. You're my heir. That's a bad idea. Okay, I was saying, I have 2,000 troops. Can I actually attack? I could maybe attack my cousin. No? Apparently, even though he's of our dynasty, he has no... I have no claim to it, and uh, he just doesn't want to join us. He is the... son of... My grandfather, Von Dodd, who was... Wait a minute. My uncle... Yeah. My uncle died, who was the brother of my previous character. So it's, they've, they've gone down one generation as well. You better be well-liked, sister. Revoked my title, minus 80. She's really messing it up, isn't she? I don't even like her. Hmm. Can I give her my duchy? No, I can't give away titles. Hmm. <laughs> oh, wow. Opportunity. Opportunity strikes. Let's see. I can't reach anywhere over there. I can declare a holy war on that, but that's kind of risky. And this guy is huge. 12,000 men.
Hmm. Nope, it's not gonna happen. I can't attack anybody. Oh, my sister's doing something big. What's she up to? Seventh Holy War for Burland. Burjand. Burjand, where's that? He would be a better... God, what do these things mean? A better what? Mobad? I don't care. No. This guy hates me, so no. Okay. Hmm. She is attacking in the Holy War for Burjand. Which is this duchy down here. So she's trying to take over quite a bit, actually. It'd be nice if I could help out. If she weakens this other guy well enough... Hey, sister. Come sleep with me. If she, um... Yeah, but if she does a good enough job at destroying his army, I might be able to sneak in my own war right after her and actually take more land than just she could take on her own. Because he's got... Ugh, 18,000. How much does my sister have? 22,000. Yeah, it could happen. But I would ideally want my war to, to start and end during her war. I wouldn't want to be caught on either side, either on my own or on the beginning or the end. I'd really like to take this. What are you in? Are you have, do you have other wars? God, she's better than I am. She's just better character. Better in every way. She stabilized the realm. She is expanding it. Everything's fine. She's a genius. She's a little bit fat, but everyone likes her. Except for the people who she's specifically pissed off by revoking titles from. Where is your army, dude? What are you up to? There's her 21, 22,000. That looks like the majority of the army. Looks like she's moving forward to have an actual battle. Yeah. I hope this goes well. Yeah, into the mountains defense. There comes another 3,000. She's getting her ass kicked. You stupid woman! Get these men down there and, and kill them all at once. Don't lose. It's painful. It's just awfully painful trying to watch this. Ten thousand. Okay, these two. Okay, here comes eleven. And this one? Come on, catch him. Number thirtieth, number thirteenth. He's gonna get away. Damn. No! Go! Get him! Okay. Here it comes. 14-4. Alright. Mountains defense. Huge troop count advantage, but that those mountains are huge. They're so, so powerful. She won. Okay, good. Alright. Now, he's gonna re-raise and have even more many, more men. It'd be so awesome if I could sneak this extra four counties while all that whole thing's going on. I think instead I'm just going to raise the men that I have and go latch. I'm going to attach them to her army to try to help out. She's got 9,000. If she can keep chasing that army down and maybe that one too and just beat it up, that would be all she needs to do. I'm get it. Come on, go somewhere where I can join you. July. Okay, they're gonna escape again. Oh, great! I'm ill.
Oh god, I'm gonna die. Pneumonia, minus four. Crap, I'm about to die. This character, my last few characters have had no luck at all. No luck at all. Okay, good job, sis. That's a good battle. Now take the next one, too. You've got the advantage. Ooh, in fact, I can even do some work here. Let's make sure we have good commanders. Or, you know, at least a commander. Oh, well, that's not good, though. I mean, they have no morale. And we've got the mountains defense, so I can actually do some work. Clean up the army a bit. Okay, and now we'll attach. We'll just contribute an extra 1,300 men to my sister's army in her effort. She's winning the war. She's doing a good job. She did better than I did. That one bad battle really cost her. She'd already have won by now, probably. I like how you can see the auto plan. Hey, I didn't die. That's nice. This is what happened. Good things happen when you try to help out your sister. Oh, I just want to sleep with her again. Wouldn't it be nice? Sounds like fun. I'm, I think... I'm starting to think there's something up with uh, concubined sisters. Because... Correct me if I'm wrong. Somebody who's watched this recently... Never mind. I take it back. I was about to say, I don't think concubine sisters can get pregnant, because I don't remember seeing them get pregnant. But apparently they can. There's got to be either my characters in general just have low fertility, or there's some kind of a penalty for it. Because I've got the ambition to have a son, which means that I've got plus 25% fertility. I have no opinion, no fertility modifiers that hurt me. So I should have a... I should be able to make babies. With anyone. Okay. It's a girl. I am my I am my wife's heir. Interesting. She is amazing. It would be a shame if she were to die. No, no, no. We can't do that. Okay, I'm going to wrap this one up here. I will see you again in the next one. Thank you for watching. See you soon.